For the first time in six years, Catoosa County residents could see an increase on their property tax bill. Dallas Payton has more on the reason behind the increase. Dallas? David, Cindy, I was told the increased proposal comes in light of inflation. The needs and calls for public safety and county services have increased drastically for the Catoosa County government. Catoosa County spokesperson John Pless says the maximum level of property tax increase Catoosa County Board of Commissioners are looking at right now is 1.75 mils. So what this really translates to for, let's say, a person with an assessed value home of $175,000. What that means is annually that's going to cost about another $117 or a non-homestead home about $121. This works out to about $10 a month. Plus expressed the current and proposed property tax is the lowest among neighboring counties in northwest Georgia. The citizens we've heard for, of course, they're not happy with uh, hearing about a possible increase on property taxes. Again, we understand that um, a lot of people are concerned of anything going up. You know, we have all experienced higher gasoline prices, higher grocery prices. Prices for goods and services continue to climb. People are also demanding higher wages for their work. People are leaving jobs and taking jobs, sometimes in even unrelated industries, for higher pay um, because the job market is so hot right now. This is an employee's market, so employees can dictate. Because of that, the county is having to make their salary more competitive, especially in public safety departments, since pay doesn't compare with other nearby counties. It is essential that we keep police officers, firefighters, paramedics, um, and the other first responders, people in public works, they're regarded as first responders as well, especially when things happen, like trees fall down, holes open up in the roadway, those type of things. There will be three public hearings later this month before a final decision is made about the property tax. You can find those dates on our Local 3 News app shortly. In studio, Dallas Payton, Local 3 News.